Ladies and gentlemen, if you are planning on dating next year, you need to know these terms, okay? Plenty of fish, POF.com, which is like, to me, like, one of the worst dating sites ever. They came up with, like, some of their annual uh, new list of new j- dating trends that they expect to see in 2024. And they came up with terms for them, too. So I have six of them. Let's run them down right now. Number one, Riz colored glasses. This is supposed to be a play on the term rose-colored glasses. And apparently Riz is short for charisma. That sounds really stupid. Um but, you know, they said basically that you meet someone with charisma and then you find out down the line there's nothing with them. Oh, sounds like my love life. Uh, number two, VBD. VBD. That's what it's called. It's short for vision board dating, meaning like you adjust your dating app location to somewhere you think of moving to to find the love of your life. Ooh, I need to try that. Uh, number three, PMI. Short for premature intimacy, it's almost like TMI, too much information, but it's when you share too much details of your relationship too early. Mm -hmm. Number four is theraposing, like you use too much therapy speak, and you act like you're more evolved than you actually are. That is the majority of Twitter and social media in general. (laughs) Number five, canon bailing uh, is, quote, cultivating your identity outside of a relationship, so basically putting yourself first. And number six is cryptic. When the person you're with suddenly feels icky because they're way too focused on one specific topic, especially if it's like cryptocurrency or something like that. It, this is a weird list, okay? I don't understand any of these, and this these dating trims make me not want to date. I'm just going to date myself for the rest of my life, okay? That's your 411. It's your girl, J Bell. On Albuquerque's number one hit music station, 93.3 The Q.